Hi everyone, on today's road trip we're going to look at a 1966 Lamborghini 400 2 Plus 2. This is a pretty unique car. Um, you don't see these 400s very often and you certainly don't think of them when you hear the word Lamborghini. And I can't tell you how many of them are convertibles. I've seen these in the coupe form but this is the first convertible I've ever seen. And it is nice. It's like a uh, steel gray or gunmetal gray maybe it's got a little metallic to it but it's a nice color and it's got like a, a camel colored leather interior look at that line here you see that that little dark line almost looks like a pinstripe it's actually a crease in the uh, bodywork it's a design feature in the bodywork and it just fades away halfway down the door and then you don't see it in the back half but when the light hits it just right you can see the crease begin then it comes around the corner it swoops down and then goes away at the bottom of the fender that's pretty unique I always liked the way the headlights were incorporated into the header panel isn't that nice it's kind of Frenched in but it's not and there goes the uh, Lamborghini emblem up front two-piece bumpers it's got the uh, parking light on top of the bumper it's got a little bezel around it around the lens and you can see that body line goes around the bumper too just little touches like that that uh, not every car has true spoke wire wheels with knockoffs know who makes these but uh, they're nice it's got something here uh, super legeria script with a little emblem super legeria let's see if we get a better view how's that it's neat it's got these little cow vents neat one piece uh, giant wiper one one wiper goes all the way across and that's a big windshield so look how big that arm is how long that reaches from the center that's a big windshield it's like a big bubble leaning back let's look at the inside obviously it's a stick I guess it's a four-speed the wood wheel look at the gauges goes up to 300 I guess that's kilometers let me see if I can get the angle right there we go my gimbal's moving around on me a little bit tack on the left speedometer on the right and kilometers and uh, I guess that's a fuel gauge in the center can't really tell can't read it it's a little bit of a glare and more gauges in the center console area. Very nice. No back seat. So why do they call it a 2 plus 2? It's a, really a 2 plus nobody. It's just you and a companion. You can see the way the top's got uh, like a ridge there to, to accept the, the roof mechanism when it comes up. And the latch is right there on the other side wood wheel the Lamborghini emblem pretty neat we go around the back here it's got a trunk which is neat there's that emblem again super legeria Milano it says uh, touring super legerio Milano can you see that? From Milan. Over here again, Lamborghini 400 GT. Two piece rear bumper. Quad exhaust. Uh, maybe it's dual with uh, splitters at the end. It's got an emblem on the side of the exhaust pipe there. See that? Not sure what that says. Can you read that? Pretty neat. 
And again, the taillights are kind of Frenched in a little bit like the front. Different. Look at the lines of this car from this angle. Pretty cool. Let me see if we can get a better look at the dash. Check out those gauges. Toggle switches and knobs and whatnot. It's beautiful in here. That's something I just noticed. Look at that trim on the door. There's actually a uh, bar. It sticks out a little bit to grab it to shut the car, to shut the door. So we can look at this side. See how it sticks out a little bit right here? And it's incorporated into that trim piece. So it kind of goes away. You don't notice it from, uh, from this angle. It's pretty neat. Little grab bar with the uh, glove box. Door handle doesn't move. It's just got a little uh, latch underneath it. You squeeze it. Got an emblem right here. Very nice. Let's look at the board on this one. 66 Lamborghini 400 2 plus 2. It's out of Marion, PA. Got some information on this one. I wonder if this is the interim model they're referring to. I guess it is. But I like this car. It's rare. It's beautiful. Love the colors. Love the styling. And it's different. You know, when you say Lamborghini, you probably think uh, Countach. This doesn't come to mind. But tell me what you think. Leave your comments below. Definitely subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you on the next one.